Hi YouTube! Okay, I'm going to continue with part two of The Big Chop. <laughs> My version of The Big Chop. Okay, now you can see the texture of the hair and you can see the texture of the relaxed hair on the bottom, what's left of it. Obviously it broke off. And I'm going to try to comb from the end up. I'm not used to doing that. I'm used to ripping it from the roots out. But, um, for YouTube, I'm going to show you the correct way to comb it. And the way I chop. Okay? Now, I can see the light shining through. This is the straightened part down here. And this is the kinky part up here. So I'm going to go right up to the kinky part and cut straight across. No point in keeping this part. Okay, now I'm going to hold it and twist it. And by twisting it, by twisting it, it becomes straight by the time it's dry. This summer, I'm going to do what I did last summer. No straightening, no heat straightening, no relaxing, no chemical relaxer. Um, as you can see, between last summer and now, 2013, um, I only have a little bit of the relaxed portion left. The natural hair grew out long enough where it made up for the hair that broke off. So, this was chopped previously. Well, I'm going to chop it again to make it more even. Okay. Now, what I've noticed is when you condition the hair, it's less kinked up than when you just wash with a shampoo and go. I think that's why co-wash is so popular. Okay. Now, um, that's it. <laughs> Thanks for watching. The next video I will show you the end result of chopped, twisted to straightening hair. Thanks for watching again.